Welcome, Journey to the Summit with Marley I Mystic. Thank you for joining me once again this wonderful Sunday, October 30th. Looking forward to a magnificent day. I'm still high off the spirit of the uh, healing circle that I attended yesterday, feeling really rejuvenated and refreshed and just revitalized, ready to face the world and all challenges that are there for me. I take them on. Also, um, a little bit down because I'm not going to be able to journey over to the city and go to the Coltrane Church today, which always gets me ready for the week and gets me going. But I know that uh, being born in sound, I can have church right here in my own home. And that is what I plan to do so that I can be in communion with those saints over at the Coltrane Church, giving thanks and praises to God through a love supreme. Feeling great this Sunday knowing that I have a lot of work ahead of me in terms of organization still, working on that discipline, organization, and structure. It's a never-ending task that I constantly pursue, and I am grateful for the energy to continually pursue it. I'm also grateful for my uh, best friend who is starting a wonderful project, a journey of her own sorts, to healing. And I'm just grateful that she asked me to be a part of it. Even though we are on the East Coast and the West Coast, we can still together journey and reach some healing. And um, I'm really grateful for being a part of that opening ceremony and being able to share this message of a love supreme with her to help her on her path to healing. So I encourage you and I love you and I'm here for you every step of the way. My BFF, you know who you are. I'm also grateful that this month is almost over and moving into um, a really warm and loving time, even though the weather isn't warm. It is a warm, loving feeling. And I'm really seeing the challenges of 2011 going into 2012 as hope and not as um, these daunting tasks, but actually as these great challenges that will bring forth wonderful aspects into my life and um, just realizations about how wonderful God is and how much work he does every day to ensure that my path is laid out. So I'm grateful for that. I just wanted to come back this afternoon. I just came back from a lovely walk out in the sun with my two little girls and it blessed me to just feel the power of the sun and power of God shining down on me. And a song um, came to mind, and I wanted to share that with you. It goes, lead me, guide me along the way. For if you lead me, I cannot stray. Lord, let me walk each day with Thee. Lead me, O oh Lord. Lead me, lead me. I love that song. I haven't sang it in a long time, but the Spirit just brought it on my heart as I was walking with my two babies. And, you know, that's really the Spirit that I need to have every day. That's what I'm journeying on this journey to the summit. I need to be led and guided along the way, knowing that following that path, I cannot go astray. So I just had to throw that anthem in and let you know that that's what my Sunday revealed to me. Had my service at home already and prayed and meditated and danced and gave thanks and even gave a little bit of a sermon here. So I am grateful for this Sunday and I'm grateful for you all. Thank you for joining in on the Journey to the Summit, and I look forward to continuing this path with you each and every day. Once again, Marley I Mystic, www.mysticmarleyi.wordpress.com, and also at Marley I Mystic on Twitter. And if you too want to be a part of the Coltrane Church community, go online, coltranechurch.org, or on Twitter at Coltrane AOC. God bless you. A love supreme.